what you wanted But you don't even trust yourself We were so, we were so, we were so high up in love But not enough to bring us back from where we fell Hey guys, welcome back to another one of my shifts of a day in the life of a correctional nurse in a men's prison. If you guys are new here, make sure you subscribe and turn your notifications on so you can get notified on all the upcoming fun. Because here, I'm always bringing along on my shift. It's always interesting. So, make sure you like, share, and subscribe. Also, if you guys have any questions or comments, definitely leave a comment down below or on my other forms of social media and I'll make sure to get back to you. So I wanted to get some stuff for my lunch just because I've been ordering a lot of takeout. I'm like obsessed with these seaweed snacks. Oh, just rolled out of bed and I look like a hot mess. Let me get myself together. That's better. Got my Starbies ready to go. So here I'm just packing my lunch. I just cut up some strawberries, some grapes. Then I had some boiled eggs and just some ground chicken with some spinach in it. Fit check. I got my royal blue scrubs on, my Adidas, my Lululemon top. Ready to go. I don't care what anybody tells me. If you look good, you do good. So I don't mind spending a little extra on my scrubs. Also, it's really hard to find petite scrubs because I'm actually very short. Why would somebody put that back in with that little bit of mouth? They should have just threw it away. That's something some kids would do. Well, at least my kids. <laughs> As you guys know, patches typically take the longest on my shift, and it actually takes hours. Obviously, this is just not in real time, but I'm going to show you the full thing, but it actually takes a super long time. Because you have to label the patch itself with the inmate number and the date, then when you collect it, they have to match the number. So, like I said, I don't think people really realize how short I am, because they just see me in a video. I'm 4'10 and a half, so I'm actually very short. done with something I'll cross it out with a pen and then after I check that make sure that everything is documented I'll cross it out with a permit marker and then when everything's done then I'll put it in the shredding. I like to quadruple check everything just to make sure I pass every medication. I mean here if I miss something it's not a big deal because it's not like somebody's gonna like die from it but like if I was in med surge and I did that like that could have serious consequences so I always want to make sure I'm doing the right thing just in case I do go into another field and then I'll already have the good habits. I said this before in my Q&A, I do love my job, I absolutely love it, but it really gives you no medical experience at all. Like I said this before, this is very non-traditional nursing. I also feel that's why many people do not burn out because it's not bedside nursing. Most of the people that I work with have been here for over 12 years. But you don't play for keeps, messing with a girl from the east side, yeah. Kinda love you, wanna build your dreams on, yeah. But I already know better, I'm a go-getter and I got me out. Good. I made over shoes and hardwood For me, you know I wrote the book I'm moving along from somebody wrong now. So go ahead Tell me all the ways you miss it How you want me back in your bed But I'm not around 
Hopefully you guys are enjoying this vlog so far. Make sure you give it a thumbs up. If you guys are new here, make sure you subscribe. Because here there's always way more fun to come. Also make sure you follow my Instagram because I'm very active there as well. Yeah, I already know better. 24K got nothing on me. Make you want it forever. Trying to play a game but you don't play for keeps. Messing with a girl from the east side, yeah. Chasing the ghost who don't try I'm tired of the show, put you up to self to somebody else It's too late Don't really care about all your mistakes You were out of your league in the first place Not even surprised that you let me down, down, down I gave you too much honestly and you closed the door quadruple check which is what you're using like here some people use lantus and some people use love a mirror for long acting and you never want to give them wrong insulin because that's an incident report it's also a med error as you guys know for me one way to stay organized is i set up for each inmate for their insulin so i can have one come in and then the next one's ready to go also that means they're not waiting around for me to be ready because sometimes they can get impatient also thanks to the subscribers that have been leaving comments and reaching out to me saying that they do in fact wipe away the first drop of blood because some of the people that I work with be like I don't do that we were never taught that I'm like well I was taught that in nursing school so I'm glad some other people are reaching out saying that they were taught that as well. Then after I'm done with everything I sit down and document before I start cleaning my area and get ready to go. Look how pretty that sense it is. As you guys know, I drive like a million miles to get to work. So I finally made it home and now it's time for bed. Hope you guys enjoy. Can't wait to see on my next shift.